Hi all, Terhi here again. I'm really happy to be back making some videos and I have some kind of special video today. Um, my kids are a bit late because of me. Uh, I didn't take my November hip kits at time because I was having a little journey in Australia. So while I'm waiting to get my actual December kits here, December hip kits, obviously, um, I grabbed a bag full of last and I think last year's 2017 and 2016 products from HipKit Club. There are lots and lots of uh, exclusive stuff here, so if you have been subscribing back then, you probably will um, see something familiar here. But there's also some crate paper and um, What's the word? Pink Press Studio, yeah, and Ella Studio too. Anyway, these are all matching together quite well, I think. And I have a couple of our family photo shoot photographs, which I'm going to scrapbook now. And with a couple other layouts, because there are so much of these photographs. So I will scrapbook all of them. But anyway, I'm going to uh, do a layout featuring two of those photographs and lots and lots of uh, old stuff. I'm, I'm, I really don't like using the word old stuff because it's not old. I mean, there's no eat before this day <laughs> kind of mark. Um, in these papers and embellishments, you can use them any year and any time. Lots of these papers and embellishments are good to use even during the summer. And I also think that most of the uh, summer things can be used to the winter layouts. It's just the way you use them. So, anyway. Back to this layout. Obviously, I have my white cardstock and I made some 4x4 four four squares. And the photographs are about 3, 3 and 3, I think. Yeah, 3 inch wide and 3 inch. What's the word? Long? <laughs> anyway, square. Um, my idea is to make super simple but very dimensional layout and the dimensional part comes from the stars I'm going to use because they are really thick. Probably some of you remembers the stars from Snow and Coco crepe paper collection from last year. Um, the gold and silver stars. It was in the same collection as these snowflakes are. Um, and they are really thick. And I really love the way they, they look. I, I used one pack last year and I'm happy to have another one here. Um, so that's why I thought to be really dimensional with this layout. Uh, these Epamera are exclusive from HipKit Club from last year, if I remember right. I'm really sorry if the years are mixing in my head now, because I don't remember if it was uh, 17 or 16, but I think this was last year's. And I want to uh, use the brrrr, like it's super cold here, and some other stuff. Um, because they look so cute and in, the, in these photographs are my girls, surprise surprise, and in the upper one are my dogs too, and they are wearing pajamas and having some fun, so brr, it's cold outside, something like that will fit perfectly. Now behind the photographs are small pieces of patterned papers similar ones 
with old photographs and then a little piece of vellum which I really like it it kind of reminds me of snow or ice or something and it goes perfect with winter layouts now you can actually see the star I was talking earlier about it's really big and kind of hard embellishment but at this point I really like it so um, what else I was saying I should have some kind of note here while I'm doing the layout yeah I was thinking about mentioning why I'm making this layout on floor yeah actually in living room <laughs> floor I don't have any kind of work table at the moment and I'm not home there was a major super huge uh, water issue accident in our house and we had to move out and the renovation will last like super long I mean half year or something so I just grab some of my crafty stuff with me uh, to the our um, temporary <laughs> apartment and now I'm scrapbooking on floor which is kind of funny and I was a bit scared that my back will hurt and it's really bad to sit on the floor but no it's actually quite fun and I love the way that wooden floor is showing on those videos I have a couple of Instagram posts that I have done that you can see how I'm doing this it's really funny um, but it's nice and I mean I love scrapbooking so why not it's not like I have to do this I could say the hip kick club that sorry this happened and I know they are people there and Kimberly will understand but I want to have my scrappy therapy sessions each week so I'm scrapping on the floor, which is fun. Um, anyway, back to the layout again. Um, I'm attaching all these layers, all these papers and vellum and photograph and everything with 3D foam because I want to be really dimensional. Um, I was a bit scared that will this actually fit to my album, but it will. Uh, there's no mixed media here, nothing like that, so it will fit there quite well. Uh, but even to these embellishments, the flags, the snowflake, everything is attached with 3D foam. I'm not only advertising <laughs> the companies I use the um, 3D foam from, but um, any 3D foam will do and I like the way it's going with the vellum because you can see um, how big the um, well you can see it all through the vellum um, I decided to add three snowflakes here even though I first thought about more but as there are four squares and lots of stuff and it's quite full of everything at least for me because usually I have lots of white space in my layouts so I decided to limit my snowflakes to three snowflakes um, there are some chipboard uh, frames uh, on the upper right square um, and they are bringing some nice thickness too uh, also all these words are going to be attached with 3d fo foam even on top of the photographs which is surprising for some but I really like to do it that way and now I'm thinking about how to attach that other 
word but as there is one totally visible this other one can be partly underneath the star and you can still see that there is brr. yeah but this is this and I hope you enjoy seeing how I created it um, I have another video coming up soon so don't go too far away and come back soon because I will show you how I created another one with these similar kind of products and as soon as I get my actual HipKit Club uh, December 2018 kits I will do some process videos again and I can't wait it's so much fun and that's a good reason to say to my family that please go away for a while I need to do some scrapbooking I know they will go away and I will have the whole huge house for myself anyway thank you for watching and thank you for inspiring me and thank you hip kid club see you soon bye